Jessica Bogey. And now, addressing you on behalf of the class of 2012, is student speaker Jessica Bogey. Good morning, Mrs. Feinstein, Dr. Yunutsi, legislators, trustees, faculty, staff, family, friends, and fellow members of the class of 2012. I would like to begin by putting our academic success into context. We represent a select group of people who have managed to complete our studies at Camden County College and graduate with an academic certificate or an associate's degree. And what better community college to graduate from the one that has maintained rankings in the top 3% of institutions for associate's degrees nationwide. Our presence under this tent today shows that we understand the meaning of hard work. In addition to our studies and extracurricular activities, we have been holding jobs, raising children, caring for other family members, serving this community through volunteer service, and serving this country through military service. The last of which I acknowledge on what happens to be Armed Forces Day in addition to our graduation day. Some of us have traveled from other counties, and other states to come here, and others have traveled from nations all over the globe. And we have all made the commute each day through traffic, construction, and bad weather, by bus or by car, truck or motorcycle, and some of us by bicycle or on foot. And others have been logged on at all hours of the day on the internet in order to receive a quality education. We may come from nearby communities and from faraway places, but we do not come from families with trust funds. We are the middle class, the working class. And that is what makes us the poster children for the American dream. The great story that inspires millions to flock to this country each year was created by people like us who shared backgrounds like ours. Great Americans like Oprah Winfrey, Steve Jobs, Martin Luther King Jr., and Bill Clinton embody the story of coming from circumstances that were nothing special and rising up the ladder to extraordinary success. And these people shared lives like ours and had the same will and determination that we do to work hard and achieve their dreams. We all have the opportunity to rise to our highest potential and to be the next inspirational Americans for the future generations. And the only people who stand in our way of us achieving these dreams are in fact ourselves, and the only obstacles that block us are our own fears of failure and the unknown. A quote that I have found to be very inspirational to my path for my dreams came to me from an unlikely source. In the recent Muppets movie, of all things, a character named Gary said, it's easy to believe in other people, but at some point, you have to start believing in yourself. Because that's what growing up is. It's becoming who you want to be. 
Now, I know this quote is from a children's movie, but its message should resonate with each one of us grown-ups graduating here today. Because we have all suffered times of struggling to believe in our own success. Because it's scary. And we fear the thought of, do I deserve this job? Do I deserve to achieve my dreams? Do I really deserve to be happy? The answer is yes. Yes, we do deserve everything we seek. And kidding ourselves to believe otherwise really only hurts us. Because it is better to work hard for the things we really, really want in life and fail than to settle for anything less just for the sake of comfort. However, I can wholeheartedly assure all of you here today that if you want something enough and you try with every fiber of your being to achieve it, you will not fail. Because there is enough opportunity in this world for all of us to pursue our own happiness. You just have to work at it and believe that you deserve it. The same way that we all work so very hard to earn the right to be sitting here today. So, as we all know, after we move on from Camden County College, each one of us will be climbing his or her own mountains to success. And at times, we will feel as if we are alone in the world. But I want you to remember here today that you are never alone. Because there are over 7 billion people on this planet. And you are all one hello away from making a friend that will be there for you while you are turning your dreams into realities. Therefore, I would like to take these last few moments to wish a thank you to wish a special congratulations to our national and international graduates in each of your respective languages. So class of 2012, congratulazione, felicidades, glukvansha, felicitaciones, galuk vincent, pajrabliayo, pavins. Bud High, Mabruk, Amadeto, Chikehe, Gangsi, Mazeltov. <laughs> and congratulations to us all. Thank you. Thank you, Jessica. I now ask that our 2011-2012 Alumna Trustee 